first two entrants are confirmed for New Japan Cup USA. I'm Chris Charlton, and this is Finish Strong for the week of March the 5th, 2021. New Japan Cup USA will return in April with eight men vying in a single elimination open weight tournament. But March sees strong style evolved and wrestlers from across the NJPW strong roster vying for one of those eight spots. Two of those spots would be filled tonight in singles matches, but the night kicked off with tag team action as the returning Carl Fredericks and Alex Coughlin took on Clark Connors and Kevin Knight. With Coughlin finding himself the new captain of the LA Dojo after Clark Connors graduated and returning from a neck injury as his partner Fredericks came back from a shoulder injury, Coughlin and Knight had an exciting exchange on the mat for Alex opened up with a lot of aggression in the corner on the new young line. The match only continued to get hotter as Clark Connors tagged in and had a heated exchange with Carl Fredericks before Carl was caught with a body slam for two. When Fredericks and Coughlin took control again, Alex showed his submission prowess with some innovative bow and arrow work on Kevin Knight, but Coughlin would take a huge pounce and a spear from Connors before a gorgeous dropkick from Knight. The dojo newcomer pushed as hard as he could, but in the end, as Alex tossed Clark, Clear out of the ring with a huge fallaway slam, Knight was left alone with Fredericks to take a rear naked choke and the MD for the win. But you know what? I'm back. I'm back. I'm better than ever. And I will never take anything like this for granted ever again. Never again. The second match of the evening was our first New Japan Cup USA qualifying bout as the DKC faced the tough challenge of filthy Tom Lawler. DKC tried to hit and run on Lawler with a drop kick and a slam on the floor and a northern light suplex that worried the MMA master, but it wasn't too long before Tom Lawler got the upper hand. Lawler was dominant in the corner before tying up the DKC and landing some hard strikes from a cravat before a classic figure four. LA Dojo's new young lion showed his guts going for hard strikes and quick pins, but a devastating front slam led to a rear naked choke, and then the PK. Tom Lawler being our first official entrant in New Japan Cup USA 2021. But New Japan Cup USA is an open weight tournament in 2021, and to prove that, the second entrant was guaranteed to be a junior heavyweight as Leo Rush took on Rocky Romero. Former high school amateur Rush and proficient grappler Rocky Romero decided to grapple on the floor and they matched one another hold for hold. But Leo Rush had the speed edge. Rocky fought back with a rewind kick and targeted the arm, which meant Rush had to use his feet to break free of the veteran's grasp. Romero brought some hard hits with a springboard drop kick and the forever clotheslines, but forever ended with a second rope lariat and a falcon arrow from Rush. As the intensity of this match grew, so did the pace, and the bout all ended with a sequence of roll-ups that saw Leo Rush come out on top to join Tom Lawler in the New Japan Cup USA 2021 lineup. Meanwhile, New Japan Cup action is going strong in Japan. This week, Yamanashi, Okayama, Kyoto, Ehime, and Aichi all see tournament action as the single elimination continues all the way until Saturday, March the 20th and Sunday, March the 21st in Sendai, those final two events with live English coverage. Wherever you are in the world, you can be there in New Japan Cup, both USA and in Japan with the king of sports streaming services, njpwworld.com. That's it, we've finished strong for another week. Until next time, Gokigenyo, sayonara.